And welcome back to Flexible Games, where we are playing Dyson Sphere program. Oh, yes. All right, I have uh, been adding refineries onto here because uh, I've researched a couple extra um, of the vein utilization, and we are, we are pulling a lot, a lot more uh, oil out of these things. And yeah, we're not even utilizing this one here. This one, I even, I added like, I wanna say like six more. And uh, the, well, yeah, these are these are backed up. So over here, as I've started, sort of started the process of maybe getting some, uh, some cracking going on. And yeah, this is gonna, you know, produce a little extra hydrogen. We are going to be able to um, use the hydrogen. So I kind of want to try to be creative with this process and uh, design a system that uses a lot of the um, a lot of the hydrogen and, and trickles in hydrogen to get it started, but after it's done getting started, it shouldn't need any extra hydrogen added to it. All right, so we're gonna we're gonna grab from this oil, of course, because this is all backed up, and I want this to be you know full blast on the oil. So let's see how can we. We're we're definitely going to be using a whole lot of splitters here. Well, the other thing I did is I added another set of yellow uh, yellow science crafters. I didn't really do anything. I added one more of these crystal ones. I didn't do anything with diamonds because I think we're uh, yeah we're still producing enough diamonds. I could always add some more onto here. We've got plenty of the um, graphite ready to go so yeah we can easily add to diamonds if we need it plus we have some of that kimberlite ore around and about someplace not sure i'm pretty sure i put a miner on it but i, I can't be 100 percent sure uh okay so we are gonna want uh let's see this is gonna require hydrogen and oil so if we go like right here, hmm, how are we going to feed in hydrogen and pull hydrogen out at the same time? I think what we're gonna do is end it up, we're gonna end up merging the hydrogen in over here right um, so the oil then is going to be needed hmm maybe I'll do the oil in the back make a fuel power excellent 6.4 megawatts good 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 uh, this one is just research speed so that's just just the information matrix but yeah I, I added the the yellows because those are really burning fast and we're not producing enough um, so I think the output on this side we will actually output hydrogen and the what you call it the uh, graphite on this side um, the hydrogen what do we get more of we get more hydrogen yeah so this will merge in back in there graphite will go places and things we're gonna then bring hydrogen in now we need oil so oil, I think, will be on the other side, like so. So this will be hydrogen. 
Um, oil, hmm. We're going to need the other type. This one here. Right there. So if we mirror this on this side, uh, should we get it in there nice and tight? So there's the hydrogen. This is the hydrogen output. This is going to go in there. Now, Mm -hmm. We're going to have a hydrogen output going this way. But our output port status will be prioritized on this side. So it will prioritize this, keep this full, any extra goes off that way. The only issue is how are we going <laughs> to... How are we going to prime the system? That's that's the question. Okay. That is actually facing the wrong way. This needs to be rotated. Yes, like that. Actually, no. How do we do this? Smartly. I think these need to be right raised up. Like so. That one there. That one there. Okay, I think that's that's what I'm going for. There, and there, there, and there. And then this, oh, those are, that was going to be the, the top tier there. We're going to raise this up. And you will flow right into there. And we're going to have to put a break in this. That should be pretty easy. All right, so I think we've got that squared away. We're going to need another belt along the back here. That's going to be the energized graphite. So we're going to have hydrogen graphite. Hydrogen and graphite. How about we do that? Graphite. <coughs> okay, now we can try our best to just replicate this. Yeah, we want an input there in there. So can we snuggle that close or is that too close? I want to say that's too close. Leave, leave a little bit of wiggle room in here. No, I wanted to copy the sorter. There we go. So sorter here, sorter here. that and then and that conveyor I want to where there it is the splitter here and there so this, well, I want to, yeah, there we go. Uh, and then we're going to need a bridge connecting those. All right. 
So far, so good. Prototype is going. And, you know, the developers have said that they're going to they're going to be working on... Oh, that's going the wrong direction. They're going to be working on, you know, making things a little bit easier to build. So you are going to be hydrogen. You are going to be that. Hydrogen. That. We're going to need a little, a little hydrogen to start the system. But again, we've got, do we need to reset the output priority on this? That's the priority right there. So all hydrogen will get fed into there as needed. Any extra will come out. So now we need one of these. right there this can come out and up and let's upgrade that there we go power should be straightforward here I think we get the best results and we can tuck power back behind here all right, now we need to figure out hydrogen. And we need just a few as a catalyst here. So I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to break this. And we're just going to grab a bunch of this. And can I... Hopefully that'll catalyze this process and, and get us started at the very least. Let's get you going. Now, did I pro I probably picked up a bunch of Yeah, let's dump that in there. Don't need that. Okay, so now we need to figure out what we're gonna do with ye old energized graphite, which is around here somewhere. Yeah, see, there's some in there. There it is, right in here. So where's the storage for that? Oh, Lord. Um, we have some over here. I'm pretty sure I'm grabbing most of it in there. So let's see if we can... Ooh. Let's see if we can sneak it... Oh, man, this is going <laughs> to... This might be the worst spaghetti yet, trying to get it in here. It's hard seeing the big picture. I get lost in uh, where we're going here pretty quickly. There's there's a graphite there. So I was thinking of tacking it onto the back of this. So let's see. I want to go up two yeah up to and I gotta make sure I let's see that and then go up three <laughs> I mean yeah I could use bots definitely an option Trying to stay on the line here, so it it's a nice 
nice connection. All right, so we need to come from all the way down here. I might want some more of these, so I'm gonna I'm gonna skirt around these a little bit. Where's my connection? There it is. There we go. It's a good start. Now I can go under. Let's see. I'm going to grab these. Yeah, and then this. We'll get fed in like that. Look at that. That that 20 hydrogen that we started with. We're already we're already full over here and backing up. Excellent, excellent. Alright, following this snaky spaghetti trail here, I should be able to then just connect this up with that. And Bob's your uncle. Look at that. We've got a massive amount. <clears throat> and that should use a lot less of our secondary source, leaving our logistics system to actually, you know, have quite a bit of it in there for other other uses. And now we have a setup for cracking oil, and we can sort of go ham on this system here. <clears throat> um, let's then connect our hydrogen, maybe even having a storage of hydrogen on this side for reasons. just in case we need to loop this back and push it into there but this should yeah be uh, prioritized this really doesn't need a priority um, if this ever gets you know sort of sparse <clears throat> or this ever gets sparse I can always prioritize our crackers because we have a ton of oil up here But we are going to need lots of hydrogen because if we look, these things here, um, we actually have the raw ore to make these. But look at the amount of hydrogen they use. A ton of hydrogen. Um, so yeah, in order to craft a lot of these, we're going to need a ton of hydrogen, which is why I want to do this now rather than later. So one there, it looks like roughly two squares separate. Lack of item, okay, uh, oil refinery. So I think that's gonna go there, so this goes there. Okay, and it looks like, yeah, one, two-ish squares between the two. Snuggle these in close. I'm hoping, I'm hoping the developers have plans for blueprints where you could just drop a blueprint down. I don't know how they would do it though. With the the grid system that they have, it would be very, very difficult to plop a blueprint on the border between two grids until unless they unless they solve this issue, which I don't think they can because of the nature of circles, you know. 
Due to the nature of circles, it would be very, very difficult. Okay, we're going to go over here, and we're going to say you, and you. <clears throat> now I need... And that's backwards again. Okay, so here, 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 and here. Very, very zigzaggy, but it is what it is. Lack of item. Are these all Mark Threes? Oh. I did not mean to use Mark Threes there. Um, I am going to need a few more of those. Mark Twos, though. There we go. Mark Twos. Here and here and here. Okay, now I can use Mark Threes. Well, let's get the sorters in, involved here. So you, you, and you, you, and you. Get around. Uh. There we go. Power. Pretty much every other setup. Same with this. Is that powered? Maybe I can get rid of that. All right, now you. Now, for the output, I want to copy the middle one, which is hydrogen, and just paste those on the insides. Now, I'll copy the energetic. Dublachis. Bingo. Okay, so what we are low on right now is hydrogen, but that should resolve itself. Eventually, it will fill up completely um, because we are producing extra hydrogen. And that's the whole point, is production of extra hydrogen. And then the um, graphite is coming out over here and adding to this setup. Which I could probably now, how much belt do I have? I have a little bit. I could probably speed this up. Ooh, I don't have enough. I heard a, I heard a, I heard a subtle urn. There we go. Uh, 
Uh, where are these going? These are going to get made into nano or graphene. Um, this is not, well, that works. And then these are coming up here. To get made into plastic. All right. Well, yeah, this is our, this will boost our plastic production. I did have a little error in here with my grabby arms. Um, I had to I had to sort that out. Two of these were not running because the grabby arms were not set up quite right. But it looks like plastic is backed up. This was actually almost out. could probably up this production you can see how they're kind of spits and starts here but I might as well go to one of the planets like Cassini oh yeah by the way I renamed my planet this little box down here I noticed I can rename my planet and lo and behold it's uh it's named home planet look at that it actually rename you can rename things um, I, I don't know if you can rename things you can't land on but uh, you can certainly rename things you can land on so how about that that is glorious we could collect some hydrogen from the gas giant not very fast though 0.26 per second um, you know that's a few a minute but not as many as I'm producing now. Ooh, look at that power. Um, I might need a couple more of these. I mean, these deuterium ferrons, three gigajoules. I'm sure there's probably other fuel types pretty much guaranteed. There's other fuel types out there that we can use. Strange matter isn't a fuel, but we can go ahead and say, hey, you and you, sorter. Give us a little bit. There we go. Now, now we're talking. Decent amount of power from those. All right. Let's go check our hydrogen situation. Um, if I can find it. We. All right, we are. All right, hashes. Oh yeah, we're gonna we're gonna burn through. We're gonna burn through those yellows so fast. We have quite a few of them in stock, but wow, we're burning through them fast. hoping these can keep up uh, maybe upgrade this I haven't had to boost my blues in forever if we look at this hey look at that holy moly we were using 84 a minute before that research hit 84 a minute now we're at 336 a minute wow so that's one two three four five six seven um i might need you and you to get upgraded Well, we can't sustain that level of, of research, but that certainly will help. Wow. Yeah, my, uh, 
My research uh, mod, my, my well-rounded mod, really allows you to tweak a lot of the things in the game. Okay, so... Those crystals are just about done. I think our hydrogen... Cashmere crystal. Um, we've got we've got hydrogen. You can see we've got little bits spitting out here once in a while when this fills up. Like I don't know what our production and consumption of hydrogen is right now. Yeah, see we're we're still consuming more hydrogen than we are using so maybe i should do one of these um which means i need 20 accumulators that are full okay which means i need one of these and can i make is accumulator a building it is. Ooh. Uh, we're going to need some crystal silicon. Quite a bit of it. I do believe we are making that up here somewhere. I need 20 of these. That'll, that'll burn through those <clears throat> those things pretty fast. These here. <clears throat> All right. Not sure, you know, how good this is going to be. I do know that it, it'll use some of the hydrogen... Um, yeah, it'll use some of the hydrogen to to power itself. So there's glass and crystal. That should be easy. The crystals. Yeah. Six of the ore plus two plus twelve. Yeah. Crystals we'll be able to make. We'll probably do those next episode. And uh, we'll see if we can't pull some hydrogen off the gas giant. But that's going to have to do it for this episode. I thank you for watching, and I will see you next time.